I started, I think we started the game pretty well. Uh, I think around the fifth or sixth minute mark, uh, a timeout was taken and um, we came out flat after that timeout and I think that was kind of the turning point during, our, during the whole game. We dug ourselves in a hole and when you dig yourself in a hole that deep, it's always tough to come back, you know, from down 20 at halftime, close to halftime and, you know, the effort just wasn't there today. Uh, we got to take this experience and learn from it, watch the film, watch our mistakes, and we got to get better for the next game because we play again in 48 hours. So. Devastating performance uh, from the fifth minute and after when they start switching, uh, we were playing bad offensively and defensively, uh, either on situations on the open court when they had an extra player running the floor after contesting shots. This is one of the things they do, uh, they're prepared for that. But obviously we didn't follow this, this uh, momentum. Uh, they, were, they were shooting brilliant from beyond the arch. Uh, we try to change the tempo. Uh, we've been in such situations going down on the second half. We played almost a tie game, lost by three. But uh, uh, as I said, uh, second quarter, but also from the fifth minute and after. So for a quarter and a half, 42-22, if I'm not mistaken. we got to make the count. After they start switching, it was devastating for us. Uh, we have the quality to bounce back. We need to get immediately in a switching uh, mode and watch the film, definitely, and criticizing ourselves. Once again, congratulations. Sorry for the fans that they came and for all the fans all over. As I said, that was not our, our, our real face on competing because it's important to compete at all the circumstances when your shots are not falling, when the layups are not falling. Uh, or they, the opponents are making shots. You gotta find a way to, to compete. And uh, that was one team, unfortunately for us, on the court today. <laughs>